probe launched. Probe away. Launching probe. Probe away. Launching probe. Launching probe. Launching probe. Probe away. Probe launched. Probe launched. Probe away. Launched. Launching probe. Probe launched. Probe launched. Launching probe. Probe away. Launching probe. Probe launched. Launching probe. Probe launched.
probe away. launched.
Launching probe. Launched. 
launching probe. Launching probe. Probe launched. Probe launched. Probe away. 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 
launching probe. Probe launched. Launching probe. away. Launching probe.
stop right there, alien. You're Shepard of the Normandy. You again. I told you the Blood Pack only wants Krogan. Go flash your smooth skin somewhere else. Watch it, human. The clan leader wants to speak with you. Keep your running pet on a short leash. Get him the right soon or put him down. Do you know what's wrong with him? What he needs? There's nothing wrong with him. Just go speak to the clan leader. Take your business to the clan leader and keep your running pet on a short leash. Get him the right sooner. Do you know what's wrong with him? There's nothing wrong with him. Someday we'll get off this rock and show those Turians who's boss. Damn right. Tear their scales off them at the Pygax meeting. not clan reports use weak encryption. I see references to a captured Solarian in the logs of the Chief Scout. Good. Talk to Scout then. Or Chief. Either one accepts. Also, I have been unable to access local medical records. I suggest asking the local clan leader for assistance with Grunt's problem. This is the great Krogan homeworld. This is the land of Kredok, Shiagar, and Viol. This chunk of rock is barely worth standing on. Never thought I'd miss the tank. Halt. You must wait till the clan leader summons you. He is... in talks. You know what tradition demands. Clan Erdnot must respond. Your reforms will not go unopposed. You risk appearing weak at a critical time. Shepard. Good enough? Excuse me. <laughs> Out of my... Shepard! My friend. You look well for dead, Shepard. Should have known the Void couldn't hold you. Looks like helping me destroy Saren and the Geth has worked out for you. Glad we didn't have to kill each other on Vermeer. Huh. You made the rise of Erd not possible. Vermeer was a turning point for the Krogan, though not everyone was happy about it. Destroying Saren's genophage cure freed us from his manipulation. I used that to spur the clans to unify under Erd not. You abandoned many traditions to get your way. Dangerous. Speak when spoken to, Uvenk. I'll drag your clan to glory whether it likes it or not. Now, Shepard, what brings you here? How's the Normandy? Destroyed in a collector surprise attack. I ended up spaced. Well, you look good. Ah. The benefits of a redundant nervous system. Yeah. Humans don't have that. Oh, it must have been painful then. But you're standing here, and you've got a strong new ship. Takes me back to the old days. Us against the unknown. Killing it with big guns. Good times. Sounds like you've got big changes ahead for the Krogan. We are making a neutral ground where all clans are welcome. Fertile females can be shared among clans. We will strengthen the race as a whole. You threaten everything that makes us strong. It will not last. Maybe. Until then, you're lucky to be a part of it. How do you maintain security with so many different clans in one place? Any clan willing to send in hostages can come in. No fighting inside the camp. Each clan punishes its own criminals. We stop conflicts before anyone dies. Then we present a simple choice. Pay a fine and deal with your problems, or your clan is no longer welcome. That doesn't sound very harsh by Krogan standards. 
Allies from other clans like what I'm doing. They help deal with skeptics. Many are eager for an outlet. Every time I've declared a clan unwelcome, my allies have destroyed them. Word gets around. What's so important about maintaining individual clans? Every clan has different customs. Rites of passage, rules of behavior, battle songs, all unique. That diversity makes us great. No clan, not even mine, was meant to survive on its own. Erdnot is the leading clan. Doesn't that make your culture primary? For now. But every clan has its unique assets. The best tacticians are Erdnot. Chorgal has the longest breeding line. Gatatog holds the oldest settlement. Others have their own strengths. We keep going how we are. The clans will end up as craters under nuclear haze. Even Erdnot. We need to rethink. Restart. What do the women of Clan Erdnot think about this plan? It was our female clan leader's idea. The neutral area is safe, and it encourages more female clans to ally with us. Attacks on Erdnot now endanger the females of all clans. Even clans that want to see me dead will defend Clan Erdnot. This sounds ambitious. How's it gone so far? Better than I'd feared. Worse than I'd hoped. It can't continue. You are going against what makes us strong. Sounds like you're not making friends. Traditionalists like Uvenk are chained Varen, always fighting, guarding their pathetic stick in the ground. When the smoke clears, I can plant the flag on their corpses and rally the rest around a new Krogan hub. Sounds like you're counting on a lot of bloodshed, even after you unite. It will be slow, but I won't change what we are. Krogan are judged by the strength of our enemies. Our worst insult is to say someone's not worth killing. I hope that works well for your people. But back to the reason I'm here. We don't often allow aliens to do business on Tuchanka, but you're an exception. I'm looking for a Solarian. He was captured by the Blood Pack and brought here. My scout commander can direct you. He's probably near the perimeter running target practice. Don't take too much of his time. I need a constant watch on the other clans. I have a Krogan on my crew. He has some kind of sickness and needs treatment. Where are you from, Welp? Was your clan destroyed before you could learn what is expected of you? I have no clan. I was tank bred by Warlord Okir. My line distilled from Kredok, Moro, Shiagar. You recite warlords, but you are the offspring of a syringe. I am pure Krogan. You should be in awe. Okir is a very old name. A very hated name. He is dead. Of course. You're with Shepard. How could he be alive? I need Grunt back up to speed. What's wrong with him? There's nothing wrong with him. He's becoming a full adult. Ah, puberty ritual. Common among species with hormone-driven reproductive urges. I don't care what aliens call it. Krogan undergo the rite of passage. Too far, Rex. Your clan may rule, but this thing is not Krogan. Idiot. So, Grunt, do you wish to stand with Erdnot? What does the Rite of Passage require? Not for me to say, Shepard. The Shaman will discuss that. You'll let a tank bred Krogan join Clan Erdnot? Only because he's with you. After all, you and I killed thousands like him. Not quite as big, but many. Clan Erdnot is strong, and the others will do as I say. They see the benefit of my vision. What happens if he doesn't do this Rite of Passage? If he was left here... He would be killed. The clanless are not respected. A tank bred, probably more so. His disposition is what it is, right or no. That's just him being a Krogan. Okir didn't tell you that in the tank. Did he, boy? This is his choice. He 
is in my blood. It is what I am for. Good boy. Speak with the shaman. He's over on the second level. Give him a good show and he'll set you on the path. You too, Shepard. How many times have you stepped in a mess for your crew, hmm? I need to go. We'll go over this another time. Watch yourself, Shepard. Tuchanka isn't safe and homey like Pharaohs and Ilos. Shepard, what can I do for you, my friend? I need to go. We'll go over this another time. Hunt well, Shepard. You see that special they had on the extranet? That crap rots your brain. You should be out hunting. Fix yourself if you can't hunt. I'll tear you apart! You don't have the plates to try. A quiet candlelight vigil is planned for hostages who died during the Batarian attack on Terra Nova. Reverend Michael Bowman, whose daughter Kate died in the fighting, is holding a non-denominational prayer service on the anniversary of the attack. I've had enough of you. Then let's end this. Don't crowd the ambassador. Turn back, human. I may be an ambassador among my people, but that doesn't mean I have to speak to the likes of you. Don't think that carrying this whelp of a croaking makes you worth my time. Leave now before my guards decide to reject you. You seem like a well-traveled croaking, ambassador. I am. Then you must know who I am. And you have to be aware that bad things happen to those who oppose me. Stand down, men. I'm starting to like this human. I am the ambassador to Urdnok from Clan Nakmor. We're a small clan based in Akratic Wastes. If Nakmor is a small clan, how do you keep the more powerful clans from destroying you? We are the clan of the great warlord Nakmor Kral who faced down platoons of Turians and won. Most clans lend us the respect our ancestor is due. If Nakmor is a small clan, how do you keep the more powerful clans from destroying you? We are the clan of the great warlord Nakmor Kral who faced down platoons of Turians and won. Most clans lend us the respect our ancestor is due. What business does Clan Nakmor have with the Erdnot? Clan leader Rex requested that I come. He and Clan Nakmor have been in talks about a more permanent alliance. With our help, Erdnot could rally others behind its banner and truly unite Tuchanka and we would gain the chance to fight in larger battles with greater plunder. I thought all Krogan want to be warriors. What makes a Krogan become an ambassador? Huh. You don't know as much as you think, human. A Krogan diplomat has to represent the strength of his people, or his clan appears ripe for conquest. I slaughtered my way to the top of my clan, human. I speak with the authority of a warrior. I should go. I'm sure you are needed elsewhere. I'll tear you apart! You don't have the plates to try. Eyes straight ahead. Don't crowd the ambassador. You again. What can Clan Knockmore do for I you? I should go. I'm sure you are needed elsewhere. Give me a reason. You go beyond yourself, Gadatag Uvank. The rights of Erdnot are dominant. How do we know it will challenge him? He's unnatural. The beasts of the right can ignore him like a lump of plastic. They know blood no matter the womb. Your barking does not help your case. I'll speak for myself. This is the tank bread. It is very lifelike. <sniffs> Smells correct as well. Your protests ring hollow, Uvank. Erdnot Rex has given us permission to seek clan status for Grunt. 
Permission. <sighs> that is good enough, if lacking in spirit. If this must stand on ritual, then I invoke a denial. My Krantz stands against him. He has no one. <sighs> My patience is tested, but Uvank invokes correctly. Grunt, who is your Krant? Your allies willing to kill and die on your behalf. How is a candidate tested if he brings backup on his rite of passage? Not every Krogan can be the strongest warrior, but each must inspire his peers to battle at his side. If the ones who know you best can find nothing worthy in you, you should wander the wastes and die alone before you weaken my clan. We stand with Grunt, as shipmates and comrades. Shipmates are not the same thing. But I grant you aliens your simple interpretation. Aliens don't know strength. My followers are true, Krogan. Everything about Grunt is a lie. You... You dare. <laughs> I like this human. He understands. I withdraw my denial. This will be decided elsewhere. You have provoked them. Reason enough for me to like you. They're your problem now. Do we need any special equipment? To begin the right, only the candidate and his cramped are required. You love battle, don't you, Shepard? The last gasp of a dying opponent. Bring your love of the fight to Grunt's trial, and he will succeed. Is that Krogan gonna be a problem? He is forbidden to interfere. Will he? During the rite of passage, you must be ready for anything, Shepard. From what you've shown me, you will not disappoint. We've waited long enough. Tell us how this works. Still your impatience, Shepard. For now, know that Grunt will be tested, and that you must adapt. We're ready. Let's do this. Excellent. This is Tachanka's most recent scar. The last surface city to fall in the rebellions. The keystone was at the heart. It has survived wars in the passage of centuries. It endures, like the Krogan. If you wish to join Clan Erdnot, you must contemplate the keystone and its trials. What will happen? Who knows? You must adapt. You must thrive, no matter the situation. Any true Krogan will. Let's get started, Shepard. Hit the keystone. Hit the keystone. First the Krogan conquered Tuchanka, 
that mastered a natural world only we are fit to hold. Keystone to continue the right.
Keystone to continue the right.
Can't reach the target. Can't target them. Gave me strength beyond my genes, which are damn good. This will cause discussion. I wonder. You say you are pure. No alien meddling in your construction. Just the warlord of Tyr. The best Krogan traits are distilled into Grunt. He's designed to be perfect. Being designed is the problem. But not made by aliens. And he is truly powerful. That is a tolerable loophole. A what? A reason to accept you. You are in a stake, but your potential could tip the current balance of the clans. You spit on my father's name, on Shepard's name, but now you stop ranting because I am strong. With restrictions. You could not breed, of course, or serve on an alien ship, but you'd be clan in name. You talk like he's a thing. You're after his power. You don't really want him in your clan. Of course not. I didn't really want to cooperate with Clan Erdnot either, but I had to. Clan Gatatog is on the verge, either of greatness or of chilling in the dust. I get traditional support if I fight you, and reformer support if I back you. Your right of passage tipped that balance too. If I know Grunt, your answer's coming at muzzle velocity. You do know Grunt. This Varen is dead.
signal at the Keystone to get out of here and leave him to rot. the rite of passage, earning the honor of clan and name. Many survive, but it has been years since a thresher maw fell. Your names shall live in glory. Front, you are Erdnot. We now own property. Join the army and apply to serve under a battle master. Shepard is my battle master. He has no match. Understood. Congratulations, or not Grunt. Accept this token from Fortak. His weapons are the finest we have. What were you called before you became Shaman? I gave up my name when I became the Shaman. I am a conduit for the rage and bloodlust of my people. It would be wrong to retain my old identity. My life belongs to the clan. I want to know about Tchanka's past. Tuchanka is a place of great gifts. It kills the weak, torments the slow, and destroys the stupid. Survival is an honor, and here, Krogan thrive. We cover this planet with our civilization, only to burn it to the ground a dozen times over. Each time, we grow stronger. When we are wise and powerful enough, we will tame the planet forever. I've never heard anyone say that wiping out their own civilization was a good thing. I'd have thought you of all aliens would understand, Shepard. The Krogan empires and clans of the past were glorious, built in great battles and conquests, but their cores were weak. How else could they have fallen? When Krogan civilization achieves its apex, there will be no stopping it, no stopping us. Tell me about Krogan rites and ceremonies. You have seen the rite of passage. Krogan suffer the rite of life at birth, and the rite of honor when they wish to be considered for breeding. The rite of firsts is suffered before a Krogan faces a new enemy. A clan leader also undergoes many rites in service to the clan. What rites did you go through to become Chief Shaman? Becoming the Shaman is excruciating. I passed through rites that made me wish to die. I carry the scars on my soul. I must perform rites each dawn and dusk to keep me bound into our Krogan nature. Our spirit is one of violence and death. I must be attuned to that. Your job is awful. Indeed. I should go. May your foes be strong enough to keep you sharp. This should come in handy. Shepard, I hope you have more blood on your hands and more tales of conquest. What better for proud warriors to discuss? I took down Saren, one of the top specters in Council Space. No small task. We have learned the strength of those who bear that title. You held it yourself, if I'm correct. I should go. May your foes be strong enough to keep you sharp. Shepard, I hope you have more blood on your hands and more tales of conquest. What better for proud warriors to discuss? I destroyed an ancient sapient synthetic, bigger than a dreadnought and capable of devastating a planet. A big tale, Shepard. 
I know you are a warrior of renown, but that is much to believe. Still, I almost believe you. If true, it is likely more foreshadow than history. I should go. May your foes be strong enough to keep you sharp. Shepard, I hope you have more blood on your hands and more tales of conquest. What better for proud warriors to discuss? I should go. May your foes be strong enough to keep you sharp. A human killed the Don't crowd the ambassador. You again. What can Clan Knockmore do for you? I should go. I'm sure you are needed elsewhere. You hear that the tank bird and the human killed the pressure wall? Everybody's hurt. As if it does as Rex herself. You just can't help making trouble. No one has killed a maw since my turn in the right. Next you'll tell me he's a Quint and craps dark matter. Guess that's what it takes to replace me. You are Erdnot Grunt. Welcome. I need to go. We'll go over this another time. Hunt well, Shepard. Shepard, what can I do for you, my friend? I need to go. We'll go over this another time. Hunt well, Shepard. Down some real. Watch it, human. Eyes straight ahead. Give me a reason. You killed that Thresher Maw on foot? Welcome to the clan, or not grunt. Honored to be a part of it. Good for you. Now go find something else to do. Those fools brought this Tomka back from a skirmish without its combustion manifold. They say it got shot off in the field. You tell me. How can you expect a Tomka to run without a combustion manifold? I've never seen a Krogan mechanic before. What? You think we kidnap Quarians and make them do the hard work? Not anymore, we don't. Any idea where I could find a combustion manifold? Yeah, I can make one. Give me three days and a barrel of Rinkal. The one they lost is probably still out in the field. It's too much to expect them to collect it and bring the damn thing back. I'm going out into the field. If I see a combustion manifold, I'll bring it back with me. If you did, it would save me a lot of work. Maybe bring back my sunny disposition. Let me get out of your way. Don't do me any favors. Now what's this? produced could be catastrophic. Perfect. Don't 
touch anything. A human killed the Thresher Maw on foot. These things would last longer if they didn't hit every crater. Step back. My Baron is hungry. Killed a thresher maw. Impressive. Welcome, Erdnot Grunt. My name is Ratch. You and your cramp will find many items of interest in my store. The human is my battle master. Of course. There's not much here for humans, but you can take a look if you want. What do you have in stock? Most of it's food and drink that's toxic to humans. Rincall's a local favorite. Don't try to act tough, it'll tear your insides apart. He's not joking. Rincall hits aliens like ground glass. Otherwise, I've got weapons, scrap, and whatever food those pie jocks don't steal. Which isn't much. Take a look at my kiosk over there if you want to buy something. What the hell is a pie jack? Off-world vermin. Humans say they're like monkeys. They come in and steal food, Rincall, whatever they can get their talons on. We started using the mounted defense cannons to stop them. Why did you call the Pijaks off-world vermin? An alien trader landed here a few years back. He had goods he salvaged from some place called Elitania. Said they were stowaways. They swarmed off a ship and started stealing food and shitting everywhere. Hmm. I can't imagine you let them walk away after that. Not a chance. One ball of Pijak dung nailed the leader of Clan Forsan across the forehead. <laughs> That's apparently grounds for execution. Everyone I talk to hates that aliens are an Erdnot. Except you. I don't have the luxury of turning away paying customers. I do enough business off-world to know that you aliens have more credits than people here do. I'm a good shot. Maybe I can help out with the Pijaks. Feel free. You can use the console out there to control the guns. Make a dent in the Pijak population, and you get a discount. Good luck with that. I should go. Suit yourself. Good, Varen. Stay. One of the children, probably five years from the right. Yeah, my eyes. I think you actually had a fertile female on one of your trips to their camp. One wrong step, Shepard. Let's see what the human can do.
One more win in the pits, and I'm retiring. Child, my son, we play tackle the Baron. You don't want anything I sell. Greetings, human. My name is Ratch. Have a look at what I, I should go. Suit yourself. This might be useful. Should I ask the female clan for right of parentage? Why bother with all the politics? You know you sired your son. That's enough. Place your bed on the pits, human. We won't regret it. I just wish. I know. Things could be different. I lost her. Here, try this. <laughs> Looks like Gers finally found someone to follow around. have been a bloodbath ever since Urza's handler was exiled. What do you want, human? You're crowding my hump. So, you're in charge of Erdnot's scouts? Why waste your time shooting at vermin? Ammunition is the one thing we're not hurting for on Tachanka. As scout commander, I have to set an example. Plus, the little bastards get into food supplies if their numbers get too high. Can't have that. You see a lot of action around here? Enough. Varen here and there, and snakes in any of the water safe enough to drink. Rex has made ceasefire agreements with some of the clans, but I still have to patrol, keep them honest. What does the scout commander do? We find out where the enemies are, and we make them think that there are too many of us to screw with. Sometimes that means harassing the perimeter, taking out a generator or two. Other times, we play hide and seek. We leave lots of tracks, exaggerate our numbers, so every clan of Tachanka encroaches on the other clan's borders? Borders? This is Tachanka. Our borders are determined by the range of our guns. We are what we are, human. If we didn't fire at them, they wouldn't take us seriously. That's not recon, that's sabotage. It's a lot easier to count their numbers once you blow some of them up. Everyone knows where Erdnot is, human. It's not like we can hide. Don't your storehouses have automated defenses? Why bother? Half of what we eat is vermin. And if we get hold of defense systems, we don't use them to guard grain. We've got weapons stockpiles to take care of. Beyond that, our women and children get the security. Your enemies go after civilians? Easiest way to wipe out a clan. Women and kids can fight, but they're always outnumbered if another clan goes after them. If it's women and children are killed, a clan's hope for the future is lost. It falls apart. We don't do that, though. Rex's orders. Even if it costs us a battle, we don't fire on non-combatants. Taking care of your food supply would help more in the long run. If Clan Jordan kills our guards and helps itself to our well-secured food, there won't be a long term. This is Tachanka. Having power and clean water means we're living in luxury. Thanks for the information. Whatever. What do you want, human? You're crowding my hump. I'm looking for a Solarian. The Blood Pack captured him and he was last seen around here. I heard about that Solarian. Poor bastard. If it's Blood Pack, then Clan Warlock has him. Sent one of my scouts to check it out, but he never reported back. Guess they got him, too. Chief told me to give you one of the trucks. Just follow the highway to Warlock's base, if you've got the quads to deal with him in the blood pack. What can you tell me about Clan Warlock's base? Last I heard, the clan was holed up in an old hospital. I haven't seen it, though. 
I've only seen Clan Warlock from a distance. If I'd gotten closer, I'd have taken a shot. You get inside, though, bring a big gun. Warlock's base is crawling with blood pack. That doesn't sound too defensible. Why'd they hole up there? Any hospital on Tachanka has to be built well enough to withstand a bunch of enraged Krogan. When an injury forces us to switch over to secondary organs, things get messy. Higher thought processes don't always transition properly. Blood rage, they call it. Any idea what they're doing with the Solarian? I assume they wanted to torture him. You don't take somebody home just to kill them. It's messy. Maybe he pissed off the blood pack, and they brought him here for special treatment. No skin off my hump what they'd do with him. One less alien on Tachanka. You don't seem to have much love lost for aliens. Don't get your quads in a twist. If I was gonna kill you, you'd know it. Rex believes we need to unite the Krogan people. I don't think we can do that with off-worlders interfering, but it's not my call. What's Clan Warlock's reputation, and how are they involved with the Blood Pack? Tough humps, and they're not friendly like we are. You ever run into the Blood Pack? Mercenary gang. Clan Warlock started it, one of the only gangs with an off-world presence. They're fanatics. Totally devoted to Warlock Guld. Whatever they did with your Solarian, Guld's behind it. But the Blood Pack has non-Krogan members. Like Vorcha. Ha! <laughs> the Vorcha. They're just like the Varen. Only they can use guns and don't crap on the floor as often. The Krogan are the only real members of the Blood Pack. Anyone else is just there to soak enemy fire. What makes Guld so special? He's got two children. One of them is a girl. Some people think he's got a destiny. Not me. I had a cousin who won 20 consecutive games of Quasar. Lucky bastard. I'd ask my cousin for a loan, but I wouldn't swear allegiance to him. Luck. That's all it is. Same for Gold. But the Blood Pack has non-Krogan. The Krogan are the only real members of the Blood Pack. Anyone else is just there to soak enemy fire.
turn nicely. What do I have to worry about?
armor. Not a problem. Indeed. On my way. Repurposed Krogan Hospital. Sturdy, built to withstand punishment. That's unfortunate. Hospitals aren't fun to fight through. What is fun to fight through? Gardens, electronic shops, antique stores, but they're classy. That body, human. Need to take a look. Sores, tumors, ligatures showing restraint at wrists and ankles, track marks for repeated injection sites. Test subject, victim of experimentation. Any idea whether what they gave him is contagious? No, appears to be cultivation of cancerous cells, aggravated by torture, malnourishment, not a virus. Probably testing vectors to attack genophage. Primary goal, not infection of humans. Humans useful as test subjects, genetically diverse, enables exploration of treatment modalities. Experimenting on humans? That kind of crap is what makes Cerberus start to seem like a good idea. Never used humans myself. Disgusting, unethical, sloppy. Used by brute force researchers, not thinkers. No place in proper science. Krogan use of humans, unsurprising. I imagine you had to do some live subject testing while developing the new genophage. No, unnecessary. Limited tests to simulations, corpses, clone tissue samples. High level tests on Varen. No tests on species with members capable of calculus. Simple rule, never broke it. Experimenting on humans? Never used hu- Used- Krogan use of humans, unsurprising. Wouldn't something native to Tachanka work better? Varen, maybe? Yes, human experiments strictly high-level, concept testing. Native to Tachanka fauna likely used later in development stages. Wise to delay use of Varen until necessary. Powerful bite. What can you tell about their experiments from looking at the body? Position of tumors suggests deliberate mutation of adrenal, pineal glands, modifying hormone levels, counterattack on glands hit by genophage. <sighs> Clever. Do you think they're close to curing the genophage? Can't say. Need more data. Conceptually sound, though. Genophage alters hormone levels, could repair damage with hormonal counterattack. How are humans more genetically diverse? More variable. Peaks and valleys, mutations, adaptations, far beyond other life. Makes humans useful test subjects. Larger reactions to smaller stimuli. I know we can look much different from each other, but Asari have a wide range of skin tones. No, ignore superficial appearance, down to genetic code. Biotic abilities, intelligence levels. Can look at random Asari, Krogan, make reasonable guess. Humans, too variable to judge. Outliers in all species, of course. Geniuses, idiots. But human probability curve offers greater overall variety. Now we've got two reasons to shut this place down. Focus on Malin. Too late to help the dead.
I am the speaker for Clan Werelock, Offworlders. You have shed our blood. By rights, you should be dead already. But Werelock Gold, the Chief of Chiefs, has ordered that you be given leave to flee and spread the message of our coming. If I flee, I might trip over the dozen Krogan I killed to get here. I think I'll take my chances. You killed our youngest and weakest human. They were not worthy of remaining near our glorious work. Inside, you will find only hardened, blood-packed veterans, tempered by savagery and war, and dedicated to one goal. The Salarian will cure the Genophage, and Clan Warlock will spread across the galaxy in a sea of blood. Appears they discovered Malin's work. Unfortunate. It doesn't have to happen like this. I can understand wanting to cure the Genophage. No, human, you understand nothing! You have not seen the piles of children that never lived. The Krogan were wronged. We will make it right, and then we will have our revenge! Half the galaxy sees the Krogan as victims. If you start a war, you'll lose their support. We have the Blood Pack, and we have the Salarian. When our clan numbers in the millions, we will not need support. When we cure the Genophage, Warlock Gold will rule all Krogan. The Krogan rebellions will become the Krogan... You talk too much. See? The human cannot hit a simple target. Labs likely through there. Can smell antiseptic. Hint of dead flesh.
Active console may contain useful data. One moment. Genetic sequences. Hormone mutagens is still steady. Protein chains, live tissue, clone tissue. Very thorough. Standard treatment vectors. Avoiding scorched earth immunosuppressants to alter hormone levels. Good. Hate to see that. Most people wouldn't be so casual about developing a sterility plague, Morden. Not developing, modifying, much more difficult, working within confines of existing genophage a hundred times the complexity. Errors unacceptable, could cause total sterility, malignant tumors, could even reduce effectiveness, worse than doing nothing. Had to keep Krogan population stable, one in one thousand, perfect target, optimal growth, like gardening. You're saying you were working just as hard to keep their population from falling? Yes, could have eradicated Krogan. Not difficult. Increased mutation to degrade genetic structure further. Chose not to. Rachni extinction tragic. Didn't want to repeat. All life precious. Universe demands diversity. Pretty it up however you like. You're talking about murdering millions. No, murdered no one. Altered fertility, prevented fetal development of nervous system. Have killed many, Shepard. Many methods. Gunfire, knives, drugs, tech attacks. Once with farming equipment, but not with medicine. What was it like working on the Genophage Modification Project? Best years of my life. Wake up with ideas, talk over breakfast, experiments all morning. Statistical analysis in afternoon, run new simulations during dinner, set data runs to cook overnight. Laughter, ego, argument, passion, galaxy's biggest problem, massive resources thrown at us, got anything we wanted. Sounds like you were pretty important. How'd you go from that to running a clinic on Omega? Wanted to heal people. Good use of last decade. Something easy, no ethical concerns. Understand rationale for modified genophage, right choice, still. Hard to sleep some nights. Do you keep in touch with your old team members? No. All changed with deployment. Made test drop on isolated Krogan clan, hit rest of Tuchaka when results were positive. End of project. Separate ways. Watching it end, watching birth rates drop. Personal. Private. Not appropriate for team. How can you agree with using the genophage, Morden? Look at what happened to Tuchanka as a result. State of Tuchanka not due to genophage. Nuclear winter caused by Krogan before Salarians made first contact. Krogan choices. Refuse truce during Krogan rebellions. Expand after Rachni wars. Splinter after genophage. Genophage medical, not nuclear. No craters from virus. Damage caused by Krogan, not Salarians. Not me. So if the Krogan banded together and formed a united government, you'd welcome that? Yes. United Krogan saved galaxy. Destroyed Rachni. Genophage, not punishment. Simply alters fertility to correct for removal from hostile environment. The effects on Tachanka are still your responsibility. You upgraded the virus that kept them in barbarism. Krogan committed war crimes, refused to negotiate. Turian defeat not complete. Krogan could have recovered, attacked again. Conventional war too risky. Krogan forces too strong. Genophage was only option. Krogan forced Genophage, us or them. No apologies for winning. Wouldn't have minded peaceful solution. We're not gonna find mail on staring at consoles. Come on. Indicate experimentation. No restraint marks. Volunteer. Sterile, wearlock female willing to risk procedures. Hoped for cure. Pointless. Pointless waste of life. I didn't expect you to be disturbed by the sight of a dead Krogan. What? Why? Because of genophage work? Irrelevant. No. Causative. Never experimented on live Krogan. Never killed with medicine. Her death not my work. Only reaction to it. Gold was to stabilize population. Never wanted this. Can see it logically. But still unnecessary. Foolish. Waste of life. Hate to see it. I didn't think you'd had much direct contact with things like this. Did you come to Tijanka after dropping your plague? Yearly recon missions. Water, tissue samples. Ensure no mistakes. Superiors offered to carry it on. Refused. Need to see it in person. Need to look. Need to see. Accept it as necessary. See small picture. 
remind myself why I run a clinic on Omega. Rest, young mother. Find your gods. Find someplace better. I didn't expect spirituality from you, Morton. Genophage Modification Project altered millions of lives, then saw results. Ego, humility, juxtaposition, frailty of life, size of universe. Explored religions after work completed. Different races. No answers. Many questions. Sounds like you were trying to deal with your guilty conscience. The doctor killed millions. Modified Genophage Project great in scope. Scientifically brilliant. But ethically difficult. Krogan reaction visceral. Tragic. Not guilty, but responsible. Trained as doctor, genophage affects fertility, doesn't kill, still caused this. Hard to see big picture behind pile of corpses. Can you really just rationalize it all away? How do you justify it? Wheel of life. Popular Salarian concept. Similar to human Hinduism in focus on reincarnation. Appealing to see life as endless. Fix mistakes in next life. Learn. Adapt. Improve. Refuse to believe life ends here. Too wasteful. Have more to offer. Mistakes to fix. Cannot end here. Could do so much more. If you need this much soul-searching to get over it, maybe the genophage was wrong. Had to be done. Rachni wars, Krogan rebellions, all pointed to Krogan aggression. So many simulations. Effects of Krogan population increase. All pointed to war. Extinction. Genophage or genocide. Save Galaxy from Krogan. Save Krogan from Galaxy. So you're willing to sterilize a species based on the evidence of a few simulations? Yes. Millions of data points. Years of arguments. Countless scenarios. All noted Krogan fragmentation as dangerous. No unified culture to support repopulation. Would have been war. Turians and humans destroying Krogan utterly. Genophage was better. Saved lives. You could have cured the Genophage instead. Brought hope to the Krogan. They'd have rejoiced. Assumes human reaction. Krogan stimulus response different. Harsh environment. Take chance to fight. Flee. Would have caused chaos in Tuchanka. Victor would have war economy. Bloodthirsty army. Galactic expansion only logical outcome. More war. Genophage saved lives. War would have ended. Look at the dead woman, Morden. It doesn't look like you saved her. No, it doesn't. Worked with available data. Only option. No other possible. Doesn't matter. Chief Scout told us to watch for you. We've taken out the guards. Get back to Erdnot. I can't. The Warlock did things to me. Drugs. Injections. Said I was sacrificing for the good of all Krogan. Experiments to cure the Genophage. Everything's blurry. Hard to think. I'll have to stay. Morton, can you get him back on his feet? Stims, maybe? Something to bolster his immune system? Understand. I'm not too sick to leave. I have to stay. They're curing the genophage. They're gonna make it all better. They have to keep doing the tests. Caution, Shepard. Patient unstable, susceptible, brainwashed. Why do you want them to keep doing the tests? This is my fault. I got caught. 
wasn't strong enough. Not good enough. This is the best I can do. This is all I can do. I'm not big enough to have a real shot with the females. I'll never have kids of my own. But if I help undo the genophage, then I mattered. Millions of children will be born. Warelock children. They're going to destroy the other clans. But... No. No, they said I was helping Erdnot. If you want to help Erdnot, you need to get back there. But it would take a real badass to make it back to camp while injured. I can do it. You? I said a badass, not some scout whining like a quarian with a tummy ache. I can do it. I'm up. And I'm going to the female camp. Damn right you are. Get back there and show them what you're worth. Go. Go. There's no pep talk like a military pep talk. Explosives useful. Burn through Krogan armor. Enemies inbound. <laughs>
what's this? You always had trouble seeing evidence that disagreed with your preconceptions. How long will it take you to admit that I'm here because I wish to be here? Maybe the Werelock brainwashed or drugged him to keep him under control. Unlikely, pupil's normal, body language consistent with standard metabolic state. Please, Professor, you wrote a paper on this. Forced behavior modification always results in mental degradation. Whether from Reaper indoctrination or drugs, test subjects always lose higher cognitive function. Not brainwashed or conditioned. Need Malin at peak capacity for work. Must be alternate source of coercion. He wasn't kidnapped. He came here voluntarily to cure the genophage. Impossible. Whole team agree. Project necessary. How was I supposed to disagree with the great Dr. Solis? I was your student. I looked up to you. Experiments performed here. Live subjects, prisoners, torture and executions. You're doing? We've already got the blood of millions on our hands, Doctor. It takes a bit more to put things right, I can deal with that. You honestly think the experiments you did here are justified? We committed cultural genocide. Nothing I do will ever be justified. The experiments are monstrous because I was taught to be a monster. Morden, did you ever perform experiments like this? No, never taught you this, Malin. So your hands are clean. What does it matter if the ground is stained with the blood of millions? You taught me that the end justified the means. I will undo what we did, Professor. The only way I know how. What happens if the genophage is cured and the Krogan expand again? That'll be on your head. We justified this atrocity by saying the Krogan would cause havoc and war if their population recovered. But look at the galaxy. Batarian attacks in the Traverse. Geth attacks in the Citadel. Is this a more peaceful universe? The assault on your Eden Prime might never have happened if we had let the Krogan recover. We'll never know. How would a Krogan population explosion have done anything to stop Saren and the Geth? An increased Krogan population would have forced the Council to take steps, likely involving colony rights in the Traverse. The Turian fleets would be vigilant for any military activity in the area. They might have stopped the Geth at Eden Prime. Supposition. Impossible to be certain. Don't you see? We tried to play God, and we failed. We only made things worse, and I'm going to fix it. You talked about killing, but the genophage isn't lethal. It only affects fertility rates. Krogan fight over fertile females. They become mercenaries or pirates because they see no alternative. They would be thriving in a cultural renaissance now had we not decided that this is what they deserved. Inaccurate. Krogan population resulted in war. Simulations were clear. Why work with Clan Warelock? And how did you access the genophage data? The data was easy to obtain. We all still had clearance. We were heroes. All I had to do was ask. As for the Warelock, they were the only clan with both the resources and the commitment. Erdnot has a larger camp than Warelock. Why not use them? Erdnot Rex is too soft. He wasn't willing to do the experiments I needed. It's Erdnot's loss and Werelock's gain. Their clan will be the first to recover from the crime we committed. Malin clearly doesn't need rescuing. What do you want to do? Have to end this. You can't face the truth, can you? Can't admit that your brilliant mind led you to commit an atrocity! Unacceptable experiments. Unacceptable goals. Won't change. No choice. Have to kill you. Wait, you don't need to do this, Morton. You're not a murderer. No, not a murderer. Thank you, Shepard. Finished, Malin. Get out. No warlock left. Project over. What if he talks to more Krogan? Tells the public about the modified genophage project? Special tasks group good at covering tracks. No proof. Warlock willingness to work with Salarian, unusual. Other Krogan will kill him. Aren't you worried that he'll start his research again? No. Locking this unit. Special task group can cut access to old data. Could start from scratch. Decades of work, though. Didn't teach you everything I knew. You heard the Professor. Get out before he changes his mind. Where am I supposed to go, Professor? Don't care. Try Omega. Can always use another clinic. The Krogan didn't deserve what we did to them, Professor. The genophage needs to end. Not like this. Apologies, Commander. Misunderstood mission parameters. No kidnapping. 
My mistake. Thank you. Don't worry about me, Morton. How are you doing? Should have killed him. Wanted to. Easier than listening. Easier for him, too. Experiments indicate how far he's fallen. Expected it from Krogan. Not one of mine. Maybe you'll remember that the next time you're discussing the ethics of the genophage. Yes. So many variables. Stress responses. Impossible to truly predict. Something to think about. Malin's research. Only loose end. Could destroy it. Closure. Security. Still valuable, though. If you think it could be useful, why not hang on to it? Worked for years to create modified genophage. Should destroy this. Malin's work could cure genophage. Don't know. Effects on Krogan. Effects on Galaxy. Too many variables. Keep the data. Better to have it and not need it. Point taken, Shepard. Capturing data. Wiping local copy. Still years away from cure. But closer than starting from scratch. Done. Ready to go. Ready to be off to Chanka. Anywhere else. Maybe somewhere sunny. Let's get out of here. anything. If you're gonna stand there, make yourself useful. I can't do anything until I build a replacement manifold for this damn Tonka. I found a combustion manifold out in the field. Is this what you need? That'll work. Faster than building one from scratch, at least. You just saved me three days' work, human. You burn my time if you want it. What's that you're working on there? I'm tuning up these machines for battle. It's a wonder this Tomka here made it back to camp. It could be worse. A couple more hits on the broadside, and this thing would have crumbled. Krogan placed so much importance on martial strength. How did you become a mechanic? How do you think those fools make it to the field to kill each other? Who do you think keeps the weapons working? Without me, there's no battle, just slaughter. I am the military might of Clan Erdnaught. How do you feel about what Rex is trying to do? The old man's crazy if you ask me, which you just did. But that stuff fixes itself. If it doesn't work, Rex gets torn to shreds and we find out who's got the next best plan. Let me get out of your way. Don't do me any favors. Krogan's hit by genophage, nuclear assaults, civil wars. They still survive. Impressive to see life adapt, continue despite circumstances. Inspiring. Should you be in here? As I understand it, Clan Erdnot has a new member. You're the cranch for the new warrior, hmm? The shaman gave you the customary upgrades, I assume. He's fast to pass off my work as his reward. Use them well. The Lord High Researcher for Clan Erdnot has no time to make replacements. But perhaps I can offer a discount. You must be working on something important. 
I was building the biggest, best offensive ordinance yet. A real ground pounder. But the new clan leader wastes my time with frivolous research. Crop genetics, medicinal improvements. We can buy that stuff from the Salarians. Salarians created genophage, I've heard. Still trust them with medicines and agriculture? Yeah, yeah. What else can the Salarians do to us at this point? It's not like they can make us even more infertile. Actually, wait, forget I said anything. You must be working on something important. I was building the big... But the new clan leader... Wait Salarians time. created genophage. Actually, wait, forget I said anything. I take it you're a scientist. I used to be a scientist. I designed weapons. Now my genius is wasted on frivolous things. Things that don't explode. My predecessor said no one would understand the true worth of my work. As I pulled my blade from his chest, I knew he was telling the truth. Not exactly what I would call effective academic peer review. I don't care what you'd call it. We value the will to use what we create, not just the ability to create it. We don't count success until the ground shakes in response. You must be working on something important. Salarians created genophage. Actually, wait, forget I said anything. It sounds like the new clan leader has some very different ideas on how to lead the Krogan. If you want to know more, talk to him directly. He's my leader. I'll not say anything else about him. Enjoy your research. Yes, yes, move along. longer if they didn't. This Varen can track him anywhere on the planet. Shepard, what can I do for you, my friend? Good to see you, Rex. Sure you can't come with us? Wish I could, but I need to keep these short-sighted fools in line. Hunt well, Shepard. Shepard, what can I do for you, my friend? I need to go. We'll go over this another time. Hunt well, Shepard. I barely survived the haunt during my right. Guess that human's got a quad. A human killed the Thresher. Shepard, I hope you have more blood on your hands and more tales of conquest. What better for proud warriors to discuss? I should go. May your foes be strong enough to keep you sharp. A human killed the Thresher Mark. Go away. The envoy to the female clans doesn't have to listen to aliens. Then let's end. Shipping lanes near Omega were recently hit by a series of deadly raids. Merchant fleets are being asked to resynchronize their IFF protocols. Then I'll push you on your plan or not run with us. We're willing to consider new directions. That's what makes my herd not strong.
Commander, you've received a new message at your private terminal. How may I help you, Commander? Is there anything I should know? Nothing right now. Anything else, Commander? That'll be all. Good luck out there, Shepard. Still hard to believe Malin betrayed me. Betrayed my work. Disgusted by his actions. Proud of his nerve, though. Always thought he lacked backbone. Hope he finds something new. Better goal, better purpose. Fewer torture tests. What about Malin's data on the genophage? His attempts at a cure? What about it? Have it over there somewhere. Not dealing with it now. Need to focus on collectors. Not important now, regardless. Appreciate you helping me back on Tuchanka. Should get back to work. Wasted enough time already. Lots to do. Talk later? Shepard, how can I help? Have you got a minute to talk? Not a good time. Trying to map contamination vectors requires focus. Shipwide infection of human-tailored virus possible if I slip. Anything else? I'll let you work. We'll be here if you need me. Grunt. I like it. I have a clan. That makes me... It makes me want to fight, not just able to. At Uvink, I wanted to disembowel him. To tear out his spine like a trophy. We started this because you were losing control. Now you sound more violent than ever. Rex said I was normal. Just had this built-up stuff because of being grown in the tank. Now that I know it's not an outside thing, and I have a place as a Krogan. I like it. Our enemies are in trouble, Shepard. And we better not run out of targets. I'm not planning on living like this forever, Grunt. Talk like that, and it won't be your choice. I'm sure as hell not quitting with a whimper. Just so you're clear where we stand. Shepard? Just checking in. How you doing? Humans talk too much. Like the tank. Come back later. That's all for now, Shepard. Kenneth, what is the new shielding gun to your power grid balance? Not much. With built-in capacitor subsystems, they have a surprisingly low draw. 
Doesn't that mean the shielding boost wouldn't last long under fire? True. They're built for hard, fast strikes, not firefights of attrition. Shepard, what can I do for you? Have you got time to talk? Sure. Uh, let me just come on, you little bushtet! Oh, sorry. I've got a small fever and I'm taking it out on the poor drive core. Don't worry, it's nothing serious. Got sloppy while doing some suit repair. You're sick? Do you need help or time to rest? Really, it's not that bad. If a stray bit of bacteria could really kill us, we'd have all died by now. The fever should go away in a day or two. Don't worry, it won't affect my performance on the mission. It's not even an illness, really. What we experience is actually an acute allergic reaction. How exactly does the sickness work? It's an allergic reaction? Right. Say I get exposed to a human disease, like... What did Navigator Presley have that time? Chickenpox? I wouldn't get chickenpox, but I'd run a fever as my system reacted to the foreign presence. Depending on where it hits me, I could get other symptoms. Nausea, vomiting, everything you'd expect from being sick. How did you get sick this time? I took some fire in a fight back on the Alarai. Nothing serious, but I needed to open my suit to check the wound. I disinfected properly, but one of the section seals had taken some damage, and foreign matter got out of the disinfected zone. It was a stupid mistake. You always check your seals before doing local treatment. Unless you forget. Then you get a damn fever. You can seal off part of your suit? Right. Like dropping emergency doors on a ship during a hull breach. It won't stop an infection that gets into my bloodstream, but it prevents a surface infection from spreading. Were your immune system stronger before the Geth drove you from your homeworld? Not as strong as those of most races, definitely. I'm not a biologist, but there's a theory about it. Because our planet lacked insect life, plants developed symbiotic relationships with large animals to spread seeds or pollen. Most viruses on our world were partially beneficial, so our immune systems evolved to be weak. They were more likely to adapt to contamination than fight it. But Quarians colonized other worlds. They couldn't all have been like that. They weren't. Most colonists went through a period of mild illness before adapting to the new environment. When the Geth took the homeworld and our colonies, the sterile environment on the flotilla ruined our immune system's adaptability. Even if we colonized a new world or reclaimed our own, we'd need a long process of bioengineering to recover. I don't know if I could live inside a suit my whole life. We are in our suits even among family. The most intimate thing we can do with another Quarian is link our suit environments. We get sick at first and then we adapt. It's our most important gesture of trust, of acceptance. I haven't trusted anyone enough for that though, except... Well, no Quarians. Um, you know what I mean. I appreciate the thought, Tally, and I feel the same way. But you don't have to prove anything to me. I know. Well, not that, that I know, but I, I didn't mean it like that. It's a... Um, wow, it's really hot in here. It's just that the tradition also signifies a willingness for um, intimacy. I wasn't trying to... It's not always like that. It's more... Um, how did we even end up talking about this? Wait a minute. It sounds like you're suggesting something, Tally. What could I possibly be suggesting? I mean, a young woman gets rescued by a dashing commander who lets her join his crew and then goes off to save the galaxy? How could she possibly develop any kind of interest in him? You have nothing to be embarrassed about, Tally. I feel the same way about you. Really? I didn't know... You never... Well, good. Anyway, I should get back to work. But thanks for coming by and talking. Shepard, what can I do for you? Have you got time to talk? I've got some work to do, but I haven't forgotten what we talked about. Later, maybe? I'll let you work. Talk to you later. Hey. What's happening? You got a lot of questions, don't you? I miss your friendly nature when you're not around. Been thinking. 
We've seen a lot of shit together now, and you're always coming to talk to me. Shepard, you got feelings for me? Because I don't need the complication. I'm not buying it, Jack. You're trying too hard. Screw you. You don't know me. I've had enough. Fine with me. Right. You're too needy. That's not my thing. Right. Stop that. Stop playing with me. This should be easy. Why aren't you easy? I don't want to deal with this right now. Leave me alone, Shepard. Just... for a while. Hey. Tell me about you, Jack. I'm done talking. Come back later. I should go. Okay. Talk later. <laughs>